factorize minus 4x squared plus 12x minus 9. So I'm going to use again the strategy of completing the square method. So I'm going to factor out this minus 4. So if you factor out this minus 4, you can write x squared. Whenever you're factoring out a negative number, the sign would change. So minus 4 times minus 3x. Okay. And this is, if you factor out a minus 4 from here, this can be written as plus 9 quarters. But this is a bit tricky step. So 9 quarters times negative 4 will give you negative 9. So this is minus 4 times, as I told you in the last video, first what you do is, you halve this. So I'll do negative 3 divided by 2 is uh, negative 3 over 2. Okay, so you can write this as minus 1.5 if you want to write this as a decimal. The next step is you square negative 1.5. Okay, and the square of negative 1.5 you can use a calculator. So this is 2.25. I'm not going to write 2.25. I'm going to write negative 1.5 with a reason. So I'm going to write plus negative 1.5 the whole squared. Okay. Uh, negative 1.5 the whole squared plus and then you take away negative 1.5 the whole squared. And this 9 quarters is plus 4.5 divided by 2 is 2.25. Okay. 2 point. Let me confirm on a calculator. Yeah, I, this is menu run. Mm, my brain is not working. 9 divided by 4 is 2.25. I was right there. 2.25. Okay. So I hope you understand. See, what we have done is we have written this something which is you have added this and you have taken away that. So this is this is not minus 4 times this has become a perfect square of x minus 1.5, the whole squared. Okay, the bell has gone for interval. I'm a school teacher. So this is, this is positive. So this is minus 2.25, minus 2.25. This is minus 2.25 plus 2.25. Okay. So this gets cancelled. So this is minus 4 times x minus 1.5 the whole squared. Okay. This is the answer. Okay. So this is, and if you want to factorize this, uh, so this, if you want to put this in two brackets, so this is minus 4 times x minus 1.5 times x minus 1.5. Okay, so just to check whether we have done it right, 1.5. I'm going to multiply this minus 4 to this bracket. So the ultimate answer is minus 4x and minus 4 times, mi minus times minus is plus, so this is 6 times x minus 1.5. Okay. So let's check. So let us now expand, okay, and see what whether our answer is right. So let us expand this and see. You should get back the question. So this is minus 4x times x is minus 4x squared, okay. Minus 4x times minus, so this is plus 6x, okay. And this is again plus 6x, okay. And 6 times... Min minus 1.5 is minus 9. Okay, so the question was minus 4x squared plus 12x minus 9. Okay, was that the question? Hopefully, yeah, minus 4x squared plus 12x minus 9. And that's what we got. And this is your. So we can see we can be very pleased with our answer and we can give ourselves five smiley faces.